Welcome to today's DDRX. I'm talking about forgiveness. The anchoring scripture is 1 Peter 4, 8. And above all things, have fervent love for one another, for love will cover a multitude of sins. Hebrews 12, 15 also tells us, looking carefully, lest anyone fall short of the grace of God, lest any root of bitterness springing up cause trouble, and by this, many become defiled. You see, no matter the issue, no matter the offense, let go and let God. So learn to forgive and forget. You know, the reason is that God won't forgive those who don't forgive others. In Matthew 6, 14 to 15, Jesus said, For if you forgive men their trespass, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. But if you do not forgive men their trespasses, neither will your father forgive your trespasses. So you treat the one you are forgiving as you will want to be treated. You know, the simple test to know whether you have really forgiven is this. If you remember the offense, because you will keep remembering, you may remember. If you remember the offense or the offender, how do you feel? Do you have rage or do you have peace? Are you bitter or are you joyful? Are you willing to show kindness when you see the person? If you don't forgive, the person is wielding a power in your life. It's as if you are being controlled by a person who offended you. So forgiveness is not about changing people. It's actually about changing you. So you need to learn to forgive. Let's go and let God. Thank you.